Warning, they are swearing this video. For your discretion advice. Hello YouTube. FMC you're back again once again of do here on YouTube or the platform. Now you guys would be asking, why are you a pen caution? My question to you, my question to that is why are you guys a pen caution? Like come on guys, it's Saturday night, everybody just wants to land in the bend, just play games in a pen caution. No, because that would be no actually that'd be crazy. Or maybe people do it. No judgment, but it is Halloween spooky season, so today I decided to make a bit of a different-ish video and before we get started, that is so much better. <laughs> oh, I can do it as any idea of the humanity in this room and just caution. I'm sweating here. But but uh, but besides that, let's get into the video. Today's video is my top five fucked up manga. And yes, we'll be swearing for you. You should be out of them? Please don't let me down. But anyway, yes, this is the second video within the weekend. I've done two videos this week weekend because of, I'm, because of the late last week of the video. So, we'll be getting to this one. But anyway, sorry, and again, I'm on preference. This is my opinion. So, some manga I think I'm more messed up than other manga or fucked up. Some manga I think I'm more fucked up than other manga. And vice versa, okay? So, for people so, so people get a question twist, this is my opinion, okay? So, Let's start off with number five, and that is the Promised Neverland. Why did that just fall? I'll oh, get it later. The Promised Neverland. Honestly, like especially these like first five volumes. Yeah, this is fucked up. I mean, okay. Just just so you guys preference, this manga takes place in an orphanage. Very spoilers like Promised Neverland, a manga that's finished, and the second half is questionable, we shall say, in terms of being bad, it's not it is the best and it has some plot points in the anime also has some counter plot points but it's different it does a total good route okay manga and anime the last one that happens but anyway but anyway the first time manga or first quarter manga the first five volumes are definitely in my opinion some of the best def definitely some of the best reading, reading I've ever read like, I remember actually when I was in high school the first chapter dropped on a kiss manga rest in peace um, and I read it and I was like holy crap I'm not reading anymore I just want to wait until the official volumes come out which I did and I picked it up and read it and yeah it's fucked up I mean the preference is pretty much these children reach the orphanage and don't know why and the time they find by the time, time they turn 10 or 11 they get shipped off to their foster families actually no the children raise his livestock for demons to eat <laughs> yeah that's a, definitely a very, very lovely, lovely thing for a manga, but yeah, no, this manga's fucked up. And I spit, but, 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 yeah, I had the whole preference of them to try to escape the, escape the orphanage to survive, so yeah, kind of has a happy, happy ish conclusion, I think. I've only, oh, no, I've only up to volume five, so yeah, but anyway, comes the land, number five. And time for number four, which is, what are you hate for this? Berserk. I will be honest, I will be honest, I think the next three picks after this are more messed up just because I do. And I'm, I'm not saying Berserk isn't messed fucked up. <laughs> it is. There's some things in this I cannot show on camera. Why? Demonetization. And we do not want that. A channel that's got 30 subscribers and it's just starting off. No, we don't. But this manga is like Berserk's fucked up. Plus, not gonna lie, everybody's top deaf this manga. Of these, there's hundreds of videos you guys to watch out there about this manga if you want to know how actually fucked up it is. So, just quick mention, was it number four? Now, number three is Tokyo Girl and Tokyo Girl Read. Why? Because this manga is fuck. Like, 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 pick any art from the, like, the start of Tokyo Girl especially, like, in Canada, he pretty much is fourth from half to half human. Like, it's fucked up, and then we get to reading, we find out the reason why Canada he turns into high say, even more fucked, like, this manga, in my opinion, has so much psychological, like, psychological torture, psychological horror, and actual physical horror, it is beautiful in a weird way. I don't know, it has, it has some kind of, kind of like chaotic beauty to it, which I find really cool personally, and that's why in my opinion, I think I prefer it Berserk. I think it's more fucked up than Berserk, because I just do, okay, that's my opinion. But yeah, but honestly, especially especially in volume 12, Total Real, when you. Trust me, that, oh, that, Mark, that one is fucked. 
Chadki, you know, the spoiler, each has to eat Heisei in order to regenerate, in order to fight against against Ashima, I think you guys called that. Again, and, and guess what? It has a sequel too, this is just as equally as fucked up. So yeah, number three, um, three is Tokyo. No, yeah, three. Okay. Going to number two, which is the Zolvon Classroom by Gene Jaisel. Now, I'll be honest, the story of this manga isn't really the most tailored, I mean, the most wide, I'd say. I say it's definitely tailored towards the certain audience, and yeah, it's, it's fucked up. I mean, just be like, cover itself and it's been like, people dissolving, and it's probably the wrong clash. But trust me, then, like, here's what I'll go. I hate this little girl. This little girl can get hit by the truck can next bit to me here. Trust me, if you read this, you know why you hate the brother. I mean, the brother. Oh, the brother. Oh, the brother. Oh, he is a uh, not a very nice person, shall I say. But yeah, but honestly, like, I don't want to say too much about this manga because it's definitely one. I think more of one of Jane Ito's less known work compared to all his other works. Not gonna lie, but yeah, I definitely recommend it. If you guys can find it, read it. It is. You'll see why. And not gonna lie, like. Yeah, I can't show that on camera. <laughs> but you know, number two is the Zone Classroom. And my number one pick, don't wanna lie, this is generic as hell, but honestly, there's a reason why it's generic as hell. Uzumaki. Now, interesting behind this, this is my first ever hardback manga. And I picked it up generally just because I saw that and I was like, oh, this looks cool. And then I read it. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> like, genuinely, the ending of this manga is one of the most unfortunate and melancholy endings I've ever read or seen or anything. Like, what happens to the character, especially the real main characters, like, is nuts. It's absolutely crazy. And also, to be honest, I think, I think, yeah, Uzumaki means spiral in Japanese. And there's a big kind of what happens. And this book, the one book is about. Now, this is going to an adaptation at some point, and I'm not going to lie. Do you recommend watching an adaptation that comes out over manga? Well, I'll let you guys know, maybe kind of review. But if you guys cannot wait for an anime, pick this up. It's literally what it's cost me £18, only so about £19, because apparently this is put over manga by £1 or £1 or what, one, or what, like, or one whatever your currency is. So, yeah. Who's a Maki? The number one that and guys that concludes my top five fucked up manga this is a short video i'm gonna pack try and pack it over time no because i'm wearing a pen costume and i want to take it off so anyway guys remember to like subscribe comment down below and also also guys i've got a challenge for you guys if we can get this channel to a hundred subscribers yes a hundred for the end of the year i will you grab it eat spam preference i hate spam I think I, I hate spam, but if we can get a channel to 100 subscribers for the end of the year, I will eat spam. I will eat this entire tin, no cuts, no no editing on camera. Not live because I don't know how to do that and I don't want to make my uh, phone catch fire, but I will eat spam. Okay, that's a challenge, guys. So let's get a channel to 100 subscribers. And with that, guys, I shall see you guys next time. Peace.